Hello guys, what is up? This is BOA. How's it going, guys? What I just ask you. Uh but yeah, just leave me. Uh I'm not running out of ideas for this channel, but please in the description down below. I said description. I meant comment section below. Please tell me what you would like to see on this channel. Okay. So uh so this guy uh, Leo Forenzio, Forenzio, am I saying your name correctly? I don't know. Um, he, he asked me, tell us about your grandma, please. And that was on the My Life video. If you want to know what's up, what's going on, uh, how is BOA here, what is the history behind the four elements, what is the history be behind BOA, go check that out. Um, I made that a little bit ago, but, I know I said but, I'm sorry, but you know, uh, he asked me, tell us about your grandma, please. Okay, so, back in the 2000s, yes, I know, it's, uh, I know that it is... I know that is, uh, what was it, uh, what was I saying? I know that is, oh yeah, I know that is, it is the 2000s, but I'm talking about the decade 2000s. Not the 2010s, but the decade before this decade. A decade is 10 years, just so you guys know that, in case you didn't know that, just pointing it out there. Um, just telling you guys, so, it's a period of 10 years. Let me tell you what a uh, period is. No, <laughs> if you get the joke, hopefully, hopefully you get the joke. Um. Anyway, so, uh, my grandma, uh, and she she's always been healthy. She's she's been cooking. She is literally the best grandma in the whole entire world. But I guess she's dead. So now, uh. Uh, so now, you know, uh, I guess your grandma's the best grandma, <laughs> but, um, so, in the 2000s, she started getting, yeah, getting sick, and not, like, the cooler kind of sick, like, she, uh, she fell, and then she kept going to the hospital over and over and over and over again, and so, you know, uh, she had macular to degeneration, I think I'm saying that correctly, um, and so, you know, she couldn't see well, uh, yeah, she couldn't see well, so, and then my, my, uh, grandpa, which is still living, uh, I think you can see, uh, in, the the video trying warheads, I'm pretty sure you can see him in the background, He's he's an old looking guy, but he is in totally in awesome shape. Uh, so anyway, uh, anyway, so you know he has bad hearing, and he has he has to have a wear a hearing aid at all times, except when he's sleeping. You know, because you want that quiet when you're sleeping. Uh, so you know, so they were a great couple. So, um, it was until the 2010s, you know, that she started getting worse and worse and worse and worse. That year, 2014, she started to go to the hospital a lot more. And, uh, I was, we were staying at their house, so, you know, it's like... I was there when she had to go to the hospital and we had to take her to the hospital. There, let me tell you, the beginning of July of 2014, there, you know, we had a, a graduation party for my cousin Nick, uh, which I haven't met until then. Uh, you know, I, we have such a big family, uh, that literally, 
uh, you know, we, <laughs> I don't even know half of my family, <laughs> literally, so, you know, we go to his graduation party, and, of course, and so, you know, she, uh, Poppy, my, uh, my grandpa, well, that's not his name, of course, but, you know, uh, so he doesn't, he doesn't trust GPSs, and, of course, this graduation party is all the way out, uh, uh, that, you know, they never, they don't know where it is because we don't live near it. It is in New York, it is in the same state, but we don't live near it, so, of course, you know, they don't really know where they're going, and Poppy doesn't tr trust GPSs, so, of course, uh, they showed up late, about 30 minutes later, an hour later, <clears throat> and so Nana, my grandma, of course, rides up, uh, arrives up in the go-kart, uh, in a go-kart, wait, did I tell you guys, she's a diabetic, her blood sugar was low, and so they, uh, of course, they, like, wheeled her around, and this is a tragic story, I'm just gonna tell you guys. Anyway, so, I have a little cousin, and then she loves to hang out with me, and so, later, uh, we go, they had, like, a little playground, I was like, uh, she was like, she asked me, hey, you wanna go hang out with me? And I'm like, okay, yeah, yeah, sure, we can go play or whatever, and so, we go there, we come back, where we were, which was cool, because it was, like, a little inside place, sorry, I didn't, uh, of course, okay. Yeah, there's a little ad popping up. Well, not an ad, but you know, I uh, just a uh, scan off, basically, kind of thing. Um, so, um, crap, where was I? Oh yeah, yeah. They eat a place where there's a bunch of food and stuff, and it looked like a ship uh, wrecked ship, and it was pretty cool, like a wrecked ship, and it was awesome. It, you know, of course, everybody liked it. They're like, this is awesome, and let me just tell you, we're in a trailer park. And so, uh, yeah, so we are in trail park, you know, uh, and so they went to, uh, their friends, or, I forget if they're, we were related to them or not, or we're just friends. Anyway, so we go to the trailer, uh, of course we come back, no one's there at the shipwreck ship, uh, that should be the name of a restaurant, shipwreck ship, go and get your wreck sandwiches. <laughs> But, um, um, so we come back, no one's there, we keep on walking, we find them at the trailer, uh, that they were at, of course, and, uh, you know, I sit down with Nana, and she's doing fine, she's eating hot dogs, um, and stuff, and then she's like, uh, she, we're having a good talk, she reels on closer to me, and she says, Will you protect me? Will you keep me safe? I will never forget the time that she said that. Because, you know, it was weird. I, I guess she could sense her death. It was weird. Because, like, I'm sorry, I had a little scratch. It wasn't on my butt. It was right here, okay? Near my pocket. Okay? Don't, he's like, oh my god, Boas is scratching his buttocks. No, no, I'm not, okay. Um, anyway, so, three, around like 20 minutes later or something like that, uh, she, she goes, uh, to leave. And, that's where she starts dying and throwing up. So, that one little kid, uh, little, my little cousin that, uh, you know, she likes to hang out with me, uh, my, uh, my godmother, Jen, she says, oh yeah, 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 go on this trail, go on the trailer, uh, get, uh, get your little cousin, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say the name, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna say the name, she says, uh, yeah, just hang out with her, put the TV on or whatever. So, I, I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, what, what channel is Disney on, and then, uh, what channel is Disney, and then she, of course, she's like, I don't know, I'm like, okay, get, uh, press a guide, and I'm like, okay, channel surfing, you know, I find Disney, I'm like, okay, yeah, yeah, here, hold this, I go outside, 
My godmother, Jen, is bawling her eyes out. Everybody is crying, and it's just horribly sad. My grandma is throwing up. I go and check on her, and of course, you know, she's dying. My dad is, uh, you know, is, uh, giving her CPR, and, uh, of course, she's throwing up in his mouth when he's doing, blowing into her mouth. My dad, uh, shared her last meal. Uh, it was a hot dog. Hot dog. I'm sorry if I said hot dog. I said hot dog. I meant hot dog. So, you know, she died right in front of my face. Of course, uh, we had to pick Poppy's car, which had a bunch of, uh, throw up in it. A uh, bunch of barf in it. And then Dad's like, get in the back seat. I'm like, why not? And then, of course, uh, he's like, fine. And then he goes in the back seat. I go in the front seat. We drive along to uh, up to the hospital. Of course, we have to wait in the waiting room for like one hour or two hours or like around that time until they announce that she's dead. And I had to, at that uh, point, I had to stay at uh, my godmother's house uh, slash my aunt's house slash my uh, aunt house and slash my uncle's house. And then, you know, I... Uh, I was bawling my eyes out. I was crying like a big dumb baby. Um, I think I was watching Taken or something like that with Liam Neeson. Of course, uh, my uncle Dan comes up. So does Jen, my godmother, and then we just talk about it. And I was, I was scared, man. I was like, I can't survive without her. And she was the best grandma on earth. And she had lots of love in her heart. And she had the best grandchildren of all time. And she was the best grandma. So, of course, now you guys know that, you know, she, uh, that her grandchildren, I mean, no, okay, well, uh, let me restart that. My my grandma, you know, her last meal was a hot dog. I will never eat pig again after that, and I haven't since. So, you know, uh, I won't get, I won't get any, th I, uh, pig is the worst thing you can eat. So it's a good thing that she ate that, so I can dodge away from, uh, I can uh, dodge that, um, that little, uh, that little piggy bullet. <laughs> puns, puns are for funs. I don't know why I said that. I, I don't know what, a lot of things, I don't, I question myself why I say things. It's, uh, yeah. Anyway, so, now... Leo, you know the story of my grandma, uh, about how she died, and she ultimately was awesome. She was the best, and you know, one time, dad couldn't afford a bike for me because we're poor, we're broke. My dad was broke, and so there he was like, uh, po uh, Poppy uh, was like, you know what, we can't afford a bike either, so don't lend him the money. Sh he lent, uh, she lent us the money, and she, let me tell you, she was so generous to all her grandchildren. She was the one who gave out uh, like $50, like 100 bucks on birthdays and Christmas and everything, and she ultimately was awesome and her death is tragic and I will not recover from her her death now I still cry about it till this day and so does dad and we're we're still recovering from it anyway I'm sorry to drop this little bombshell on you if you enjoy this video please like comment share subscribe and support have a happy day instead of a sad bony day rock on